Local fire department spent the day training for a crisis at XNA. Five News reporter Katherine Gilker shows us how critical this training is for the airport and the first responders. Here at the Northwest Arkansas National Airport, they want to be prepared for any scenario. That's why today they held a full scale training exercise involving more than 150 first responders from Benton and Washington counties. This type of full scale training with a mop plane on fire is required by the Federal Aviation Administration every three years. Very important what we're doing today because it puts our all of our components in play with um, aircraft uh, emergencies, aircraft response if we have a crash. The Northwest Arkansas National Airport brought in a simulator from Missouri that lights on fire. XNA Fire Chief Chad Breeden says trainings like this one really help build their confidence. We're able to put all of our uh, mutual aid departments in the play. Our we we going to go through our airport emergency plan. Um, and put that into place. So it, it helps bring everybody together to be able to train together, to work together for when the real incident happens. Students from Bentonville High School stood in as the victims. They were all in a bus away from the fire and were rescued and evaluated by first responders. This exercise involved first responders from more than half a dozen agencies in Benton and Washington counties. Bentonville Fire Department Division Chief of Training Joey Beckett says you can never be prepared enough. The communication aspect is typically the hardest part of these drills and so we work on that and understanding that our skills are going to go across the board regardless of what type of call. but understanding how to talk to one another and how to work together in that situation to make this a seamless transition if there was a real event. The XNA Fire Department doesn't just respond to calls here at the airport. They also help out by responding to calls in neighboring cities. At XNA, covering news where you live, Katherine Gilker, 5 News. All right, Catherine, thanks. Those other fire departments that were at today's training were Rogers, Centerton, Bentonville, Heifel, Springdale, Cave Springs, and Fayetteville, along with Central EMS.